Today we resized a set of connecting rods for our customers 258 AMC. First step after cleaning is to grind the rod in the cap mating surface on our sun and cap grinder. Next we take it over to the belt sander so that we can deburr that edge real quickly, which helps aid in safe bearing insulation. For the next step, we'll get the bolts pressed into the rods and get the caps back on torque to spec so that we can move over to the rod home. At this point, the diameter of the bore is actually smaller than it is from the factory, but the honing machine allows us to gradually take out materials so that we can hit that precise specification. Most connecting rods give a tolerance range of around 5 ten thousandths of an inch, and we like to size them right in the middle of that range. A lot of the connecting rods that we resize in our shop end up being sold on our website or on our eBay store, but since this is for a build here in the shop, we're going to move on to installing the press fit pistons. The process involves using our Goodson rod torch to heat up the small end of the connecting rod, which expands it just enough for the piston pin to slide in before cooling and achieving the interference fit. 